All right, so today, well, I do like 30 videos in a day, but this video is Real Things White People Have Said to Me by Superwoman. Hey, she funny, man. Let's do it. I don't get your panties all in a bunch. What up, everyone? It's your girl, Superwoman. And a lot of people ask me if I've ever suffered any extreme cases of racism. And to be honest, no. I I'm did once. to say that I haven't. But since moving to LA, I have definitely had some people say some ridiculous things to me. But here's the thing. I find it effing hilarious. Here yeah. are real things. The that person I was with, we laughed at it. My dad's name is Sukwinder. I mean, it hit me afterwards, but we just kind of laughed at us. Hi, Dad, Sam. Oh my God, you're Indian? I loved Slumdog Millionaire. So your last name's Singh. Are you related to Ranveer Singh? You know, one of my co-workers is Indian. What a small world. So he looks like an Indian when he wants, and I wore the full costume and everything. <laughs> my best friend will find it funny. I expect funny. you to get married at 23. I even belly danced to Bollywood music, and I wore that little dot on my forehead. So why aren't you a doctor or a lawyer? Are you allowed to have a boyfriend? I went to Little India once, and I got the best tandoori chicken. Do you speak Indian at home? Are you a very strict Hindi? So is your real name Lily? Stop lying. I've never met a real Indian. She clapped that flat iron. <laughs> She's Indian too, right? It's so terrible. Everything you see in movies about India. He ain't doing Indian. nothing but looking at Google screen. Spicy, right? <laughs> you know who you look like? Mindy Kaling. You look so exotic. I thought you were from Brazil or something. You know, I've always wanted to visit Delhi. My friend went to India last year. It changed his life. So where are your parents from? They're from Punjab. Uh... That's in the Middle East, right? I will take the veggie burger, please. Is that because you're Islam? Do you have to get an arranged marriage? Did you experience, like, a lot of racism growing up? So you're not allowed to have sex before marriage, right? Really? That's like the one crazy. that he's doing now? Of course I think, right? I don't believe that every person who says something ignorant is trying to offend me. I think maybe they just don't know any better and yeah. no one has schooled them. So this is my attempt to make you understand. Here's what the reverse would sound like. If I spoke to white people, how they spoke to me. Yeah, my dad's name is Peter. Pita? Pita. I'll just call him Bob Jones. Wait, are you white? Oh my god, I love Taylor Swift. Wait, wait, Smith? Are you related to Derek Smith? He's also from America. Oh my god. The girl who served me a latte at Starbucks this morning was also white. So I totally get you. I went to a white wedding once. Beautiful. But it was so short. And your families are so tiny. You probably tell your mom to shut up all the time. I even did the chicken dance and wore a tie around my forehead. So cultured. Wait, so you're not a country singer? Are you allowed to be a virgin? Ooh, I went to Burger King once, and I loved it! So do you speak fluent American at all? Or British? Or Scottish? Irish. Do you restrict English? So is your real name Sarah? Yeah. Oh my god, I know like nine white Sarahs. <laughs> Wait, do you know Ellen? She's also white. Why hers is so much funnier? It's so terrible. Everything you see in history books about white people. Oh, you probably want something with no flavor, right? You look exactly like Jimmy Fallon. <laughs> yeah, like your features, everything. Wow. You look so common. Oh, I've always wanted to visit Utah. So cool. My friend went to Ohio last year and he said his life was exactly the same. And you're from Chicago, right? Mm-hmm. That's in Europe, right? Um, I'll take the steak and potatoes. Is that because you're Christianity? Do <laughs> so, like, you to fall in love or are you allowed to get arranged? So do you have like a super hard time recognizing your privilege or are you aware of it now? Oh, I, I don't have any privilege. Okay, so you're not. Is it hard to have so many options when you're shopping for foundation? Crap, they don't have any eggnog on the menu. Do you drink anything else? But look at your hair. Can I touch it? I want to cry right now. Wow. <laughs> that is so soft. Is that natural? Yeah. It's beautiful. Look at his hair. Look at it. Yeah, touch it. So what's the religious symbolism of the hat? Wait, so let me get this straight. You actually turn red in the sun. <laughs> like you change color. That's crazy. She oh, said no! Culture people called Super Size Me. So sad. So did they like expect you to be pregnant by 16? And there you have it. It's not meant to be offensive. <laughs> Aren't you actually related to someone named Renvier? 
Okay, what's this like? And didn't your parents actually want you to get married at a really young age? Shouldn't y'all be doing like the YMCA or something? Get that behind you. Get away from you. It's all about one love. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Like hers was so much funnier than what they did to her. Like, why? Wow. Like, <laughs> I almost want to do another reaction with my best friend because, like, we joke about stuff like this. That's crazy. But like the one time that it happened to me, I was with a friend, and like we kind of just like joked it off. But like it hit me later. That, you know, that's not cool, but, you know, sometimes you just got to joke stuff off like that. You just have to. You can't let it get under your skin, you know. It is what it is. One promise, true story.